hello and welcome. Rihanna still possesses the Midas touch when it comes to music, beauty, and fashion, as her highly anticipated return to the Super Bowl stage demonstrates. With the resumption of their partnership, it's not surprising that Puma wants more of the pie. On Wednesday, the athletic apparel company announced the news via Instagram with just two simple words. With the Fenty and Puma logos displayed side by side, she's back Robin Rihanna Fenty, a Barbadian multi-hyphenate, joined the company as creative director and global ambassador for the first time in 2014. The partnership resulted in footwear and ready-to-wear collections, one of which was a creeper version of Puma's most popular suede sneakers. The most recent collection that Fenty X Puma released in spring 2018 was inspired by motocross, and the duo also held a pool party at Coachella the first weekend of the festival that year. Savage X Fenty, the singer's lingerie and loungewear line, was launched in May 2018 and sold out immediately. Since then, it has opened stores in cities like Los Angeles, Las Vegas, Houston, Atlanta, Philadelphia, and others. In May 2019, Rihanna launched her Fenty luxury label with LVMH, making her the first woman and person of color to lead the group's brands. In 2021, the brand was shut down. The Instagram post's caption simply states coming soon, and this year's Coachella could be an ideal time for the grand re-debut of the Fenty X Puma collaboration. If Riri's previous runway shows are any indication, the new launch will show no signs of slowing down. Don't be surprised if it's inspired by Y2K or has a completely new style. Shop some of the best Rihanna merchandise below, including the cult favorite Fenty X Puma Creepers, her most recent Super Bowl cosmetics collection, and best sellers from her fashion and skincare brands. On online consignment and resale platforms like Stocks, Therial Real, Goat, and even Amazon, many items from previous collections are still available. Rihanna's Fenty Puma Creeper sneakers earned her the title of Shoe of the Year at the FN Achievement Awards in 2016. The well-known shoe might come back at this point. In a two-word press release issued on Wednesday of this week, Puma CEO Arne Frunt announced that Rihanna would be returning to the brand. She's returned. In 2014, the singer worked as creative director for Puma's women's apparel line. This union set the stage for her own collaboration, Fenty X Puma. In 2018, Rihanna and Justin Bieber split up. The Creeper was the most successful of her numerous footwear and apparel launches during her tenure. The shoe, which came in a variety of colors, became a huge hit and was popular with both men and women. It was seen on famous people like Cara Delevingne, The Weeknd, and Gigi Hadid, and it got a lot of attention and sold well all over the world. Puma's website crashed when the first release sold out. Rihanna stated to FN at the time, I never would have imagined an honor like shoe of the year. To have so many people share my love for the creeper and to have made such a mark in the shoe and sneaker industry means so much to me. In 2016, when the star went to the awards show, she walked down the red carpet in a set from the spring 2017 runway by Vietmans and Juicy Couture. A pair of black and white Fenty Puma Creepers completed the ensemble. Rihanna was seen mingling with Dasha Polanco, an actress, and Cuba Gooding Jr., an actor, who were also present at the event. Rihanna stated that the honor made her proud to be a woman, and proud to be a young woman from Barbados, especially to come to America and just do this by default, just because I like to wear a certain style of shoe during her speech at the awards ceremony in New York. Rihanna gave Jalil Weaver, a friend and collaborator, the credit for introducing her to Billy Walsh, Mr. Completely, and Puma at the time. I would send them each pair of sneakers individually and ask, can you creep this out for me? She mentioned the style's source of inspiration. I desired that this shoe be a part of the Fenty brand. Rihanna stated, because that was what I was into at the time, I wanted it to be the first thing people saw. I had no idea that so many people would adore it as much as I do. Hope you enjoy the